You were the one in the atomic oceans when molecular seasons rose and dissolved, when nothing mattered and our pockets were empty. You were the one who opened the gates. You were the one when Aphrodite fell from the moon at daybreak, when the sun came out at night so we could see the islands being born, when we lost our way in the halls of the mansion and had to choose once more between a halo and a crown. You were the one on the road that night when Bacchus met Freya between Venice and Rome, and when our recipe for secrets disappeared from the wall and we descended the stairs to the floor of desire. You were there beside the archway when our paths got tangled and time divided evenly between peace and despair. When the inner wars at night became a spectrum of colors that kept us from dreaming while we talked in our sleep. You led my heart, which was wires and coils, electrons and voices, and springs unwound from the clocks of birth. And in the cold rivers of morning, your eyes turned violet, your hands became velvet, and your mouth was now the sun as you sang its light into the opening sky. And now, in the half-light of evening, as our trajectory falls through the yawning window of a sky that closes, when the bells start to ring and the meteors fall and the first stars of night fade into your presence, you light the pathways through memory and tunnels to the gray lands where I wait for mysteries to arrive. And even now you are there, waiting beside me, for you are the one on the borders of night.